Welcome to part three of my scrapbooking basics. Uh, this time I'm going to show you how to use our thin cuts. So I have a little um, binder that I use to actually keep my thin cuts in uh, because Close to My Heart sells these little books. It's really handy and the page protectors and our thin cuts come on four by six sheets, magnet sheets, so they slide in there lovely and it just makes it super easy. So I'm going to use these today to show you how to uh, cut them. Oh, a little bit tight. <laughs> I didn't trim that one down. They're a little bit tight, but there, they do fit. Okay, so I'll get this out of the way. Okay, I have a Cricut Cuddle Bug. Um, it was just the machine that uh, was available and seemed to be the right size for me. I had tried a different one and it was too small and I was very disappointed. But anyway, this is a, a Cricut Cuddle Bug. Cuddle bug, sorry. It's very, um, very compact, so I like that. It's very easy to store. Um, so what I want to do is I want to take my circle. I've already stamped my image, and I'm going to take that, and I'm going to. Oh, I guess I need to actually turn this the right way. Sorry. So it runs through my machine. This is my base plate. So I'm going to put my paper down on the base plate. I'm going to put my circle around the image. Now, what tends to happen is these things easily can shift. So I'm going to take a little piece of washi tape doesn't matter what washi tape, any washi tape works. You just take a little bit of that washi tape, you hold this down where you want it, and you just put that washi tape down. That's gonna hold it while you run it through the machine. So I'm gonna take my plates, so I got a B and a C plate. That's what I'm gonna put on here. I'm just gonna move this out of the way so I can open up my cuddle box. So I'm gonna take that, pop it open. It has a little suctiony thing once you pull those open so it holds it there, the handle tucks in even. It's, it's a great, this is a great tool for traveling in Verges. It's just so compact. It's nice. So then I'm going to take all three of these. I'm going to set them here. Then it starts, you see the, my handle moving there. Then I'm just going to run it through. I hold on to the top and I run it through the machine. It's that simple. Pull that out of the way and I can show you. So take those off. A little bit snug only because it's pushed it into my plate there gently pull the washi off and there you go it's really that simple thin cuts are so fast so easy I didn't think that I would end up bothering with them because I do have the Cricut and the Cricut cuts pretty much whatever you want especially a simple circle but man <laughs> it's so nice sometimes to just be able to grab this piece of paper your stamped image and just run it through super fast it just is so handy to have that so that is it it's that simple now I can use this on my card I hope you have a great day if you need have any questions just go ahead and post them in the comments